Hello students, how are you? Here I am your English teacher and my name is Manimala Kumari. Today I am going to teach you English grammar and my topic is naming words. Naming words means the name of things which we see around us. Before more explanation, let's read this poem. Okay, come on, you will read with me. Girl and boy, book and toy, hat and bat, rat and cat, clown in a town, wearing boots and a gown. Come and join this game of noun. Noun. Yes, children, we are going to read about noun through this poem. Noun. What are nouns? Nouns are naming words. The definition I have written, already written here. Naming words are the names of persons, person, place, animal and thing. You can see children here, I have underlined some words. Like girl, boy, book, toy, hat, bat, rat, cat, clown. Town, boots, gown, these all are naming words. Now let me tell you which are the names of persons, places, animal or thing. Girl and boy, these are the names of persons. Book and toy, hat and bat, these are the names of things. Rat and cat, names of animals. Clown, name of person. Town, name of place, boots and gown and these are also names of things. So we underlined here the naming words. Now once again I am repeating this definition. Naming words are the names of person, place, animal and thing. Naming word, the thing which you can now see wherever you are sitting. You can see many things around you. Suppose you are sitting in your drawing room. The things just see around. What type of things you are seeing there? Many type of things like TV is there, table, center table is there, sofa is there. Many things are there. So children, once again, I am going to show the pictures to Make you clear the name of person, place, animal and thing. See here. Name of, names of places. See, this is a playground. Playground we go? Yes. Police station, hospital, temple, bank, mosque, market, park, school. These all are the names of places. Names of persons. The person... Children, you every day meet many types of persons in day-to-day -day life. Who helps you? While you go, when you go to school, you meet with your peon bhaiya or didi. You meet with your friends. You meet with your teachers. So these, they all are persons. In outside of our house, we meet with our neighbor, uh, watchman, many persons, doctors. Uh, your friends, uncle, aunt, they all are names of persons. Yes. So now, see names of animals. This is also very easy. All types of animals. I think many animals you have see, seen in the zoo. So see some of the animals picture I have pasted here. Like lion, horse, monkey, crocodile, dog, cow and ox, elephant. So these are the names of animals. Children, for showing the things, I have kept many things here to show you, which you see in your house. Bottle, it's a glass, spoon, pencil box, umbrella, key ring, scissors, pen, sketch pens, pencils. Children, I have kept two plates here also. In uh, first plate, I have kept some vegetables. And I think you are well known with these names. See, what is this? Brinjal. What is this? Cucumber. Tomato. Potato. You are seeing the children that each and everything has its a name? Okay. Here again, I have kept some fruits. 
in a plate see oranges i have kept grapes i have kept so i just want to show you the things whatever we see in our house outside the house or wherever each and everything has its name and these names are called naming words children i think you have understood now what are naming words so the last not but not the least naming words are the names of person place animal and thing so children again we will meet in next video with some new topic i think you have understood whatever i have taught you today thank you have a nice day